the fuck? What's cool like rabbits? Because rabbits have sex. So they're cool? Rabbits are cool. <laughs> they fuck all the time. Yeah, rabbits are rabbits are cool. Hey guys, what's up? <clears throat> uh, Michael, did I catch you up guard? <laughs> no, I'm always vigilant. <laughs> He's I'm... Like, I'm ready for every episode. So, oh, we got... Uh, I'm going to pet this rabbit. <gasps> oh my god, the rabbit literally just ran away. Okay. Cool. Well, that's what they do. You know, you get close to a rabbit, they're like, fuck, human. I always wanted, you hear the, I've never had like a squirrel feed from my hand. Have you ever had a squirrel feed from your hand? Probably wouldn't let it even if I got the opportunity to. They do have like really scary looking hands. Like they could just grab onto you and crawl through you. Like by the time you knew it, it crawled through your butt and out your mouth and you wouldn't even, like in a matter of seconds. Like, like how most, did you do that? Like most animals. Yeah, well, well we're not going to talk about what you do in your personal time. Okay, good. And could you take care of that giant pile of fucking poop gerbils that you have down there? <laughs> they're dead, Alex. They're not going to do it again. Take the care gerbils, of them. they're gone. Put them to rest. <laughs> <laughs> this watch you go, you go into my laundry room and there's just like a, like, a, like a big bucket of gerbils. Gerbil bin. Just covered in <laughs> shit. <laughs> covered in shit. <laughs> Man, can you imagine what they saw at the last seconds of their life? <laughs> Probably your fucking hairy legs. The, the, light, the, the light of a tunnel on the other side. Ah! Hi, Bobos. There. This this wash runs behind many of the houses in your street. You can usually find all sorts of weird junk that people have thrown out here. This is Goosebumps, guys. Episode two. So, if things get kind of crazy and a little bit sexy, just be prepared. Yeah, and like we said in the last episode, this is episode two of Goosebumps. So clearly, we're desperate. Uh, like and comment on the video. Appreciate it. <laughs> Found a sneaker. Let's keep that. I'd imagine we're just like though. carrying all these things like in our hand. A sneaker, a shrunken hand, a rose. Just like, oh, just minding on my own biz. We gotta keep an uh, eye out for Gigi. Are you reading what I'm reading? It's the fingers real. wrapping around you, tightening the pool, crush, rushing towards your face to get breath and hold it. Clenching your eyes shut. Moments later, you realize you're, it's your imagination. Oh, okay. My my controller is vibrating like. Is that why you're intense? Yeah, I was like, oh my god, something happening. I'm right not now? intense right now, but you're the one feeling the vibrations. I, well, yeah, that's what I'm like saying. Marky like Marky Mark, dude. <laughs> Marky Mark is okay. Yeah, well, you know, we, well, I like to think we're better than Marky Mark. No, we are, for sure. You know, when's the last time I beat up an Asian dude? Never. When's the last time I got beat up by an Asian guy? Twice. <laughs> <laughs> it was a math fight. He beat the shit out of me. Oh, oh God! Is that Gigi? Gigi, calm down. It's definitely not Gigi. What in the <laughs> is wrong with that? Dog? I think that's a sewer rat that got <laughs> into a bunch of cotton balls. Yeah. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> what the heck? First off, you take several large gasps and try to calm down. That dog attacked as soon as you entered your neighborhood. Thank goodness it's on a leash. Get a get a shorter one, lady. Jeez. Yeah. Looks like she's bothered by you. It's like, uh, stop freaking my it, dog out. It looks like every 90s evil woman dog. You know what I'm saying? Like, this is... Yeah. yeah. Can I not go to my home? Okay, we're just gonna... Keep walking. I'm gonna keep... You know what I'm gonna... Hold on. It's like, I think that lady is supposed to... <laughs> give her My rose. lady? <laughs> she looks down at the item in your hand and... Okay. All right. There's nothing we can do. <laughs> Good dog. <laughs> we could maybe put the top hat on top of the dog. It just all of a sudden, like... <gasps> Thank you. Like the soul of a 1950s gentleman goes into her. Hmm. Thank you, Kanta. <laughs> I am back I'm, to the mortal realm. I'm gonna go do opium. <laughs> like they did in the 50s. <laughs> Lovely. Uh, cheerio. Well, this is a... why. How the fuck does this house have an aura that changes the sky? The thunder <laughs> and dark and gloomy. We gotta go in the Goosebumps house. <sighs> what do you mean? I can't... This is my home. I don't have my house key on me. Is this really our home? Yeah. Just open it. Just kidding. Um, I gotta go b behind my house? What kind of a rock of ghetto. is this? Is it wrong to say something's ghetto? No, it's not. Oh, thank God. That psycho dog's gone. Go back. I love how they just made me go there and come back. Just for that. We gotta find out. There's a dope T-Rex toy. I'm taking it too, you better believe. Dang. Yes. I have, I'm gonna have, I'm gonna have just like pages of junk. <laughs> it's fine. Take the tire on the swing. <laughs> Can I? <laughs> you swing it. <laughs> Fappy swings. Whee! You giddily run. The moment passes and you reluctantly lower yourself on the Whee! ground. 
You hold the swing until it stops moving and step away. Life's so much more complicated now that you got off the tire swing. Dude, 10 years from now, you're going to wish that swing was still around. <laughs> Mom's going to sell it in some, like, effed up garage sale. Who the hell would buy a tire on a test your rope at a garage sale? Who knows, man? <laughs> Is that a key? Is that the secret key? I love how that's where they keep it. It's like poking out, too, so you won't have to try to look hard. So just in case you forget that it, you, that's the hiding this spot. This is a Charmeister Elite Ultimate Grilling System. Good to know. No, oh, see if I can just go to the back door. All right, you have three seconds to name, name the title of a Goosebumps book. One, two. Don't go in the basement. Three. Okay. I gave you. A that was bit that was, no, thank, yeah, thank, thank you for that extended pause. I think I appreciate it because it, it did take me a second. Uh. Say cheese and die. Say Cheese and Die is a good one. Uh, they got the Monster Game Show one. Which one's that? Oh, that's when they go to the the amusement park. Mm -hmm. I can't think of the name. You're standing on the porch, and then you skip the text. Guys, do you like watching this where we just like skip everything? Or we're just talking about random dumb crap. Or would you like it when we do half and half? <laughs> <laughs> All right, slip your house key into the lock. Cross your fingers. It's about to go. Uh, bok bok, like a chicken. Yeah. Because I'm about to get out of here. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's go instead. You pull open the heavy door and enter the house. Mm -hmm. This is without a doubt not your house. Mom <laughs> would never let the entryway get this dirty. You can smell the dust. Whoa. <laughs> so like, should we leave? <laughs> yeah. I like to imagine, like, his house that he's used to is just, like, a little tiny nice blue house. But he's like, wait, this, is, this should be my house. Hey, yo, what's up? I'm just drinking a gin and tonic. <laughs> uh, excuse me? <laughs> oh, my name's Old Lady. Crone, a toothy grin spreads across the woman before she speaks. There you are, fatby. Come give me a kiss. I feel, let's give her a kiss. This, this could be sexy. <laughs> this is like the beginning of a porn, me. dude. All right. Now drop him. <laughs> it's a child. We gotta she be, smells like dust. We she gotta smells. be chill. It's a child. It's a child. That'd be one to is an elementary. School. No, we could be chill. We could be chill, but Thank you. crone, crone, but she might not chill be chill. And... Um, no, That's yeah, better. Uh, yeah, Aunt Dahlia poured a glass of prune juice. Oh God. Yeah. Uh, oh, wait. Yeah, well, drink it. I need to keep regular. Yeah, I'll keep uh, prune juice is good for your poops. You hold your nose and take a large gulp, hoping to finish it quickly. Suddenly, your muscles tighten. Exhaustion creeps over you, and your vision blurs. You feel. Older. <gasps> like that one. Oh God. Your shoulders hunch. Grasping is grossing your voice. You think it might be nice to take a nap for a few minutes. As you close your eyes, you look up at Aunt Dahlia. <laughs> She's laughing. <laughs> she stands over you. What? Oh, so that's I how that works. Died. Okay, so I gotta be more careful here. What? Yikes, three children materialize before your eyes, which you are rubbing in this blue. This really is a haunted house. Is this the Goosebumps Power Rangers? Well. The boy mumbles quietly as you approach. I want to hear the song, but I can't find it. He digs into his foot and he carpet nervously. If I look, it'll wake mom and dad. Okay. Mm-hmm. You try to get to the attention and he looks toward you. I live here, you know. I hate going into the basement. He looks away, embarrassed. After a moment, he continues. You believe me, don't you? No sooner do you look at her directly than she starts shouting. You're not supposed to be here! Get out of my house! Strangers aren't uh, out in. Go uh oh away. Go uh oh away. Go uh oh away. You okay there, buddy? I had she a glares. I'm sorry. <laughs> it's, it's fine. You're still living. It's okay. Uh, she glares, willing. Uh, you out of existence. Can't fool me! She grumbles. I was born on a leap year. I know things. I don't know what that's supposed to mean, but... Well, thank you, ghost children, for all your... Apparently, that... they're referencing ghost book... Uh, ghost... Ghost book... Ghostbumps movies. Or... Alright. What's... What's... what's uh... Let's decline the prune juice. I want to give her a kiss, but I want to decline the juice. Yes. Crone. That's better. Down the hatch? No. No. Oh, uh, is that a way to treat your Aunt Dahlia? Your mother wanted me to look after you today, and you're already misbehaving. 
Uh, demand proof. If mom sent you, then what's the password? Think you're a little <laughs> old to need a password? Your mother can trust you to pick out a stranger, can't she? What password are we talking I'm about? I'm backing away. Well, you know, it's, uh, my mom, um, used to say that if I was ever, when I was younger, ever got, someone ever tried to pick me up from school. Oh. Stranger danger. Stranger kind of danger. Thing, like you ask them what the password is. So they're like, hey, you know, your mom sent me. Well, what's the password? You put some distance between you and the woman. You're a stranger. Leave me alone. That's right. <laughs> Happy. Fine. I guess you won't get these big milkers. It's like, uh, Crone, I don't want your saggy, dusty ass milkers. Yeah, you keep that prune. First off, who's decorating here? That's a creepy clown picture. <laughs> it's dude. terrible. Um. Looks like there's something glowing in the corner. Uh, the den is where the family gathers to watch TV or just hang out. Let's see what that looks like. Can't, oh, it's a film camera? It's a roll of film. You can load it into a camera and take pictures. All right, I'll take it. You got the Atari two-player sticks right there. Going ham. Let's play. Yeah. Aren't there enough video games? What? Okay, loser. I didn't know Fappy sucked. Really? You, Goosebumps, you can't just put like a little crappy, creepy arcade game for us to play for a second that maybe has a clue in it? Or just like a Ghostbusters reference? <laughs> yeah, something. Uh, you um, move in for a closer look at the clock. Uh, okay. So, the pendulum. Oh, it's uh, the cuckoo. One, the cuckoo clock. One thing. What year did the cuckoo... Uh, come out. That's the one we'll choose. Don't do it. Don't do it. No, I don't. I, I don't think I can actually choose one. There has to be. Like it well, just says, look. The little tabs seem to mark different years. These demonstrate just how old this clock really is. Yeah, that this uh, Goosebumps book is about a brother no, who I, wished yeah, his sister wasn't born and or then, something. Or no, and like uh. And it goes in the past, and she never was born. Yep, I remember. I know what you're talking about. And he like. He fixes it. He doesn't fix it. Yeah, in the end. No, the, the sister never comes back. Yeah, no, she does. Well, something happens where... Yeah, something upped up happens, but, like, I believe he wasn't born, the sister was. Mm. It was some, like, weird thing where, like, he the sister he did, did come back, I think. And peek through, it just leads to the laundry room. All right. We'll have the answer for you next episode, guys. Oh, God. Because I'm going to look it up, because I need to know. That's, uh... I watched a Goosebumps list. Of like uh, on YouTube, kind of like th this year sometime, mm -hmm. where they're ranking all the TV uh, episodes, like from be uh, worst to best, and that was like up there in one of the good ones. And, and I remember uh, him just talking about it. I was like, I was like, that's pretty effed up, because it has a bad ending. You know, I know it's a bad ending for sure. Come on, I want to open this. There's like definitely a, a head, a dismembered head in there. I can't like turn it off either. Dude. Sniff, sniff, ugh. We sniff in Crone's underwear, yeah. She won't catch us uh, under here, yeah. We just open a closet to another dimension. Let's jump in this. Oh, it's the Big Dipper constellation. What's the constellation prize for going in? Uh, what's at the, that? You stand at the foot of infinity. <laughs> it's like MC Escher, right? I don't know, guys. Uh, Michael called it earlier. We are going to see you at the foot of infinity next episode uh see you there